Hey guys, it's Goblin back with another video on the channel. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to easily transcribe your audio and video file to text on Glot. I'm also going to show you how to translate your video from the default language to any language of your choice, which is super helpful if you have viewers from other foreign countries. So before we go straight into the video, if you are new to the channel, my name is Godwin. On this channel, I make how to videos, reviews, video editing tutorials, and text to speech related content. So if you are interested in that kind of stuff, check out my other videos on the channel and subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on our next videos. So without wasting much of your time, let's jump into the video. I am going to leave the link to the GLOT official website down in the description box below. When you get to the website, you will get more information about their services and how their tool works. So before I show you how the GLOT tool works, let's talk about the pricing structure of GLOT. GLOT has a free plan which comes with 20 cents per minute of automatic transcription, 30 minutes max file length, 200 megabytes max file size, and over 100 languages to transcribe and translate your work. Next is the Pro Plan coming at $9.90 per month, comes with 15 cents per minute of transcription, 60 minutes max file length, 400 megabytes max file size, and 100 plus language to choose from. And lastly, the business package starts at $19 per month, it comes with 10 cents per transcript, 120 minutes max file length, 2 gigabytes max file size, and 100 plus languages to choose from. You can choose any of the plans you want, and you can also top up your credit once you exhaust it. I am going to log into my GLOT dashboard and show you how it works. On the dashboard, you will see your data on your subscription, total minutes of transcription done on the site, total expenses, and total files transcribed. My account is brand new, and I haven't done anything yet, so let's transcribe one of my YouTube videos together right now. Click on the transcription tab and choose the video or audio from your computer that you want to transcribe where you can insert your YouTube URL. So I'm going to go into YouTube and find the video and copy the URL and paste it. Choose the language used in your video and click on upload to upload your video for transcription. When it's done uploading you can choose between the automatic transcription which costs 30 cents and the human transcription which costs $19.99. I am going to go with the automatic transcription and if there is any error I can manually change them. It's going to take less than a minute or more depending on your video length to transcribe your video. When it's done transcribing the video, click on the open button to preview your transcription. You can listen to your video and transcript in real time. Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to walk you through how to automatically synchronize your audio with your video in Filmora 11. In the older version of Filmora, we had to manually synchronize our audio with the video, which makes it easier to detect mistakes or errors and correct them manually. When you are done making corrections, click the Save button to save your corrections. You can also export your transcript as a PDF file, Microsoft Excel, plain text, Word, or as a YouTube subtitle, etc. When the subtitle is done downloading, you can upload the subtitle on your YouTube video. I already have an English subtitle on my video, so I'm not going to upload it. We can also translate our transcribed video into any language of our choice. Depending on your channel, you can add multiple foreign subtitles in your videos for your audience. I'm going to go with Hindi because most of my viewers come from India, and Hindi is the most spoken and popular language in India. So to translate your video or audio, click on the translation tab and click open on the video you want to translate. Here you will see all the details, translation rate, and the total price you pay for the translation. So for a 3 minutes video, I will be charged 97 cents, I'm going to choose my target language as Hindi, and the translation type as subtitle and click translate. In seconds your video will be translated to your desired language. I made a mistake and ended up having two translations. Click on open to see your translation. Now I'm going to export my translation by clicking on the export button and choosing YouTube subtitles and it will automatically download to my computer. Now I'm going to go into my YouTube studio dashboard and find the video. Click on the subtitles option and add a new language. I'm going to choose Hindi and click on the add button to upload my subtitle. Click on the upload file and choose your SRT file from your computer and click on OK to add. Next click on the publish button to save your subtitle. Now I'm going to refresh my tab to see if the subtitle is visible on my videos. 
Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to walk you through how to automatically synchronize your audio with your video in Filmora 11. In the older version of Filmora, we had to manually synchronize our audio with the video, which took a chunk of our time while video editing. With the new release of Filmora 11, it's now possible to sync audio with our video with just a few clicks. So to get started, download the Filmora 11 video editing software from the description below. If you don't have it installed, so guys, that's how you transcribe and translate your videos using Glot. So you can create transcripts and translate YouTube videos for clients or for personal use on Glot. I hope this video was informative and very helpful. If so, smash the like button and subscribe button to not miss my upcoming videos on the channel. Also, check the link in the description to try out Glot for free. And also remember to check out Mike Monster. I use Mike Monster to voice over my YouTube videos on the channel and also for this Glob review video, so try it out. If you don't like it, you can always get your money back. Check the link in the description to try it out.